Hi guys, how's it going? My name's Chris. This is Code Vein on PlayStation 4. Let's just continue. I think in this video, we're just going to be like lost here. next. I'll lead the way. Just tell me uh, where we're depths. going. Gonna be this one. Blood of impurity, and I hate the boss from this one. Don't but be over eager. Come back immediately if you sense danger. We do have a uh, companion in this, so this boss should be should be a bit easier to do. So I'll still got the poison build on this hit on this character. Uh, just two more skills left to max out, and then I can switch over to the next. one. Out this area. Go, let's go up this way first. Don't get too wild out there. Ah, appreciate it. Bring it any time. I'm just going through this is going to be a little bit easier because I've already got um, a bit like over leveled for this. Look, enemy down there. I'll just switch to my sword. You have to take whatever you can use. <sighs> so I could probably just use a Yako to take out all these. He is killing it at the minute. Making sure I'm not missing anything. I don't know what I like better. I see something. Two more of these ball things. I think we can put that to good use. Yes, yeah, so that's the key. Whatever well, we're up here.
Yeah, just avoid they're, they're pretty slow use. attacking, so just avoid their big attacks. Take out the little things first and then finish them off. Um <clears throat> The next ones are a bit harder. Especially solo. Solo they are an absolute pain. All this, all this side done. Let's go down and take out these guys. Ah, appreciate it. Can we go? We can go down this, this little. What's that? We got something we can use. I'm over here, just missed. <clears throat> Red spot. at any time. Um, slow dead end. Uh, let's go back this way. Go through that, yes. Well, I'm just gonna look uh, get lost. It's a bit hard to see in this area. Currently, it might just be the fight. Fight. This too. Oh, it's been lit. Oh, that's a nice thing to have around. Oh nice, one shot. Um, why would they have a fire here though? It's hardly... Look, it's not that big of an area. One of the things I like with the big weapons, they've got like the charge attack, which can knock um, a lot of enemies over that way.
Oh, Hanamakura Lightning. Prepare now, so you don't regret it later. Except, uh, what was the scaling down though? Just about lightning damage. Well, I guess it's cool if you know the, the elemental weaknesses and they kind of use that to your advantage. But I haven't a clue <laughs> what is going to be uh, what the weaknesses are, so ah, appreciate it. don't need to worry about that. Okay, so we've, we've actually maxed out those skills, so I could switch to the one now. Is it worth it? Um, do I even know what it is? It's the assassin anyway, so it's uh, attack. Yeah. You take two handed weapons to a slow. Which might not be a bad thing. Um, Uh, let's do it. The assassin, ultimate for melee combat, features gifts that are great for surprise attacks. Um, let's see what we can do with this. Uh, so, Night Stalker, reduce the amount of sound you create, making it more difficult to be detected. Cool, we're not going to use that for this though. That's going to be down here somewhere. Um, so, I am going to put the fire weapon on because I think that's. Uh, pretty useful in all situations. Also, you've got trap, uh, scatter right car in the area, creating a trap that stuns assailants. Cool. Throw that on there. But mainly, we, we're just going for uh, just to uh, level these up so we get them. No way, Mark tempor temporarily applies a stun effect to your current weapon. Nice. Overdrive temporarily increases. Your and your partner's attack, the effect ends when you take damage. Throw that on there. Got these ones. I got like. Yeah, we've got that one on there. Uh, Merciless Reaper ignores some of the enemy's physical defense and weapon defense for your next attack. Temporarily reduces stamina consumption. The effect ends when we take damage. Just that. Yep. I think that might be both them. Oh no! Shadow assault. One fast and short range uh, charge. Defensive skill performed with one-handed swords, halberds, and bayonets. Um, that might be might be pretty nice actually. I'm gonna put that yeah actually put this one off the attack up um and what else was it those will pop this out reduces guard stamina usage and dodge speed back gift friendly partner over you no that's just active, so it's probably that's active when been twenty. Yeah. Um. <laughs> so let's go take this out. Uh, just to, I'm just gonna take this one. I'll just throw this skill in there, and that is gonna be everything. Give this part of it. Nice. And then we're going to go over to these. Uh, sharpened fangs increase damage dealt by a special drain performed after a parry back attack. Do not. That one. Are there any others? I think that's it. Everything else is just going to be what I want to have on there. Uh, so stamina. And we're going to create dexterity. I think. Can we do it? Let's try for dexterity. Dexterity up. 
weapons are using a dexterity weapon. So it's gonna give us like fat rolls, fat movement. Which is back to this. Uh, so we're just gonna have a heal up here. Purify this. And let's get boost in. Our stuff. If I could hit the thing. Yeah. I think I need to do the charge attacks. So if this was, uh, so in solo this is going to be really hard to get done, but you can kind of just kite them around a bit and just try and find an opening to attack. Um, probably a bit easier on, uh, in range. A magic build. There, we did it, no worries. Let's go take on the boss. Hopefully we can get this done without too much issue. I do hate this boss though. this area done. <sighs> uh, next video is back with the main story. Let's go guys. Hopefully see you again in the next video. Take care.